Hey guys, it's the Earth Elemental. In today's video, is going to be showing you guys how to use the 3D model of the Lego mouth. And it's going to show you how to do it. So, first, you're going to have your Lego character. I'm just going to go ahead and get my character. Alright, I got my 3D character. Now, this is the one I've already um, rigged with the Elemental Space Rig, but I'm just going to delete that. And I'm going to append the new one. All right, I got the new 3D head with the uh, mouth. So I'm just going to go ahead and go right here. It should be resized pretty normally uh, with the other character's head as well. Actually, I'm just going to do that. And then I'm going to do that, make it way easier. All right, so you want to select the, the root right here or just the whole rig for the head and just put it right here. It might be scaled down a little bit. You could just scale it up to make it good. Of course, if you see this, you could just go in here and disable it so you won't be able to see it. Then you're going to select the root again, select the rig, the armature, select the head, control P, and then to the bone. All right, so now the head is set. And now we can actually use this. I deleted uh, the unnecessary stuff for the other rig. But this is the same elemental space rig. It is free, you can still use. You might have some bugs, but you just have to basically just bring it up a little bit, make it a little bit better. But here is the 3D mouth. Now, I'm going to show you guys what it can do. Uh, for now, I'm just going to show you that we have the jawbone and the regular bones for the mouth. So you can make it talk. And of course, it's going to uh, have this little thing right here. Just bring it up. I'm going to tell you we got, uh, that bone is a little second. But you can use this to talk. The next one is just for the teeth. I'm going to show it right here. Got the teeth bone. Well, this is the lip. Uh, well, yeah, this is the lip bone. You can use that. This is the teeth bone. Uh, it may where you don't mess with it as much, so you can have it in place. Same with the upper teeth, and you get the lip bone for the top lip. And in the inside, it have a tongue that you can have. It's already textured. And the inside of this uh, texture, get this right here, have it load. All right, now it's loaded. And as you guys can see, it has the textures on the inside of the mouth. Of course, you could change it if you want to. If you want it to be dark, you can have it dark. Uh, all right. As if you want it to be like that. Uh, got the teeth. I had a model to make it look as good good as possible you can probably change that in the next update but we'll just see if you guys like it or not and for these bones on the side these are just for when you want to talk or make your character have emotions so this one was shown earlier you could just close the mouth it'll go back to his original state and of course you can't really open the mouth with the upper lip or the bottom but you could use it like as if it's chewing something. The character's chewing. I have to turn this off. It's kind of hard to see. But you can make it where your character's basically chewing it's like some food or something. And then the other one, go ahead and turn this back off, is the one where you make it smile. And where you make it frown look sad so another thing is you have to turn on simplify now unless your computer can run everything uh, you probably have to turn simplify on just for the viewport because everything look normal with simplify off the thing is it'll just be really buggy really slow but when simplify is on it goes fast but the difference is of course is this might not look good when you're, you know, looking back, but it will be perfectly fine in the render. 
So I'm just gonna leave that back on. And this one here is the E and S for when you're talking. So I'm just gonna have it right here so you can see what I can do. This is for, I believe, the E and the S, whichever one you want to use. And right here is the O and the V. Get the O. It might be a little glitchy, but again, just simplify. And the V, make it a little like this when you're looking. It looks like a V. And. Yeah, it's pretty much it for this. You have the bone head, well, yeah, the bone for the head, of course. But you won't be really using this. You could just hide this if you want, because you're really going to be using this bone. It makes everything better. And then you have the, of course, the Elemental Space Rig, which just comes with the stuff for the eyes. That you can use. So, yeah, this is just the tutorial on how to use this. You're just going to have to import it append it to your file, your project file, and you want to replace the original head and even the face rig if you have one with this. So you have the Elemental Space Rig and the 3D Mouth. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy.